back with another video. This is going to be the December Glossy Box unboxing. This is my last Glossy Box. I got this box with my thousand Glossy Dots. And so this is my last one. But it was a good box. So let's check it out. Um, this box was the prettiest box I've gotten since I've been enrolled in Glossy Box for like a year. And so I guess, you know, the last box is the best box. It's very pretty. And, yeah. It's just really cool. I like it. And on the inside, this looks like, I don't know. I thought it was really pretty. And these boxes are made really good, too. So, let's see what we got. This month, instead of the little card that they usually give you that opens up, they had a bigger one. And it opens up like that. It shows you the products. So, let's see. I'm going to do this so I can value it up. Okay. First thing I pulled out of the box whenever I opened it, I saw it was the biggest thing in there. Was... A Gwen Stefani perfume, Harajuku Lovers Pop Electric Spray by Gwen Stefani, retails for $25. The one they have advertised here is that one, but mine is the pink one. And I'll go ahead and just take it out so you can see what it looks like. I've already smelt it, and it smells really good. That's what it looks like. And it's really cute. Um, the smell is, uh, I don't know what to compare it to. Hang on. It's like something I can't compare. Something different, like. Kind of sweet. I don't know. It's kind of sweet, though. And the packaging is... Super adorable. I was very pleased. And last month I got the Rihanna Crush Rollerball Perfume. And this month I got the Gwen Stefani. And that was that. Like I said, retails for $25. Okay. Next, and I'm wearing this right now, is the MDM Flow semi-matte lipstick and it's in the color bossy I'm gonna go ahead and show you what my lips look like and uh oh okay. anyways this is what the packaging looks like and that's the lipstick a matte brown color very pretty I've been thinking about buying a brown lipstick and I couldn't find one I liked this one is great I like it a lot it retails for $18, and I really like it, and I like how it's in like a little gold packaging tube. Okay, next. Next, I'm going to go ahead and show you this is the Vichy, um, Vichy Laboratories Mineral Pearl Pur Purifying, Mineral Pore, not Pearl, mineral pearl purifying clay mask. Excuse me, I did use this earlier because I wanted to let you guys know how it did. Sorry, I'm tired. And um, it says to apply a thin layer on your skin, let it dry for three to five minutes. I let it dry for ten minutes. Um, it gave my face kind of a warm effect, not nothing burning, not um, not like a tingle. Nothing like that. Just a kind of a warm scent, sense to it, to your skin. And it felt really good. And then I rinsed it off after 10 minutes. And my face felt really soft, really renewed, really fresh. And this retails for $20. And I've got one Vichy product from them before. Really like Vichy. And I liked this product. I could probably get about... 
I'll say probably about eight to ten uses out of this, depending upon how thick or thin I may use. Um, if I like this time, I kind of did a little bit more thicker than thin. Um, yeah. Anyways, I think eight to ten uses, probably. And next we have the Me 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 Beat the Blues Skin Illuminator. It retails for nine dollars. It's a highlighter. And I have not opened this product, but we may open it now. I don't know if, if I can get into it. I don't have nails. Okay. There we go. I'm just trying to see what it looks like. Oh, okay. There's like a little brush. And... not used a highlighter in some years but it's very pretty I like this I like this a lot I actually will definitely use this <laughs> okay um retails for nine then we have a Luxie this is the first brush I've ever got from a glossy box a Luxie Beauty um Onyx Nowhere small tapered blending brush in number 231 retails for $16 and I'll have to try that out this box valued at $88 and I liked it, it was a really good box it was a very good farewell glossy box box <laughs> Um, I did enjoy their boxes, but I'm more into the boxes for makeup, and I was generally just getting skincare products and stuff, and I just wanted more makeup. I'm a mother of a 19-month-year-old and a baby in the belly, and I don't get to do much for myself, and I don't really go out and buy makeup, so I like the boxes to get makeup and do all that, and so I just wanted to get more makeup products. So I got the Boxy Charm, and that video was uploaded along probably with this one too. It's uploading right now, and then I'll upload this one. Anyways, definitely enjoyed the last Glossy Box, and looking forward to many more Boxy Charms. But as the last box, I thoroughly like it a lot, and the box is really pretty, and I was pleased. Hope you guys have a good day. If you like my videos, subscribe. If you want more videos like this or you have suggestions, please leave a comment. Give me feedback. I need to know these things. Have a good day.